2013. My name is Lisa Williams, and let's see if identity theft happened concerning my bank account, uh, concerning my Social Security uh, uh, disability, concerning my bank account on any month. It doesn't happen, matter if it happens next month, the month after, the month after that, any month in the next two years. I'm in San Diego, California. I'm a target of what is known as gang stalking. And we're also going to see if they take me off a of disability. I've been on it for 20 years. And we're going to see if these individuals take me off of it, trying to use normal experience, experience, appearing excuses why they do. They have me so fearful about going to see a doctor concerning my disability because this organized crime in the system has direct tentacles to doctors. They're directly connected to county mental health, doctors in area hospitals, psychiatric wards. Any psychotherapist or any psychiatrist can be infiltrated because this is organized crime in the system at the military, federal, and state level. And if you don't think that they cannot infiltrate doctors, go to Google and type in a gang stalking tech, everything you need to know. It's a manifesto of a manager of organized gang stalking crews. And if you can't directly find the manifesto as a result of typing that in, you'll see it copied and pasted in some of my blogs. And you could probably just find one of those blogs just by typing in the same thing. And it flat out mentions they're directly connected to doctors. The doctors are called the money bags because that's where they make the insurance fraud. But since they are aware that I am a complete, total whistleblower concerning how every uh, concerning who they are, how they operate, what they've done to me and my fellow targets, um, they know I know everything. And just concerning my own personal story, I already know the military is connected to it. Well, I'll put it to you this way. Is there a high, high concentration of military in my family, including my ex-husband? Where did the technology that is attached to gang stalking come from? The military. You would not believe what I know, and they know I know it. So they're going to take me out of Social Security using normal appearance means. Probably the excuse that we don't have any updated medical um, uh, information concerning you. Then they might send me to one of their doctors, and he'll say I'm not disabled anymore. Yes, to create total and complete financial destruction which will create circumstances and then they'll try and influence me to go to places they can influence or control from behind the scenes and this is how they operate it's organized crime in a the system they're directly connected to charities churches self-help groups non-profits um, uh, uh, homeless shelters domestic violence shelters you would not believe what I know and you better be damn sure they know I know it. And since this shit is connected to directly connected to human trafficking rings, sexual servitude rings, prostitution rings, racketeering of all forms, which includes identity theft, you better be damn sure they're going to do it eventually. I got to get, I'm in San Diego, California, and today's date is 423, 2013. Got to get.